Welcome and happy Sunday everyone. This is Rowdy and time to give you our weekly preview for the week of June 22nd. Kingdom of the Week is Merlantis. Got some interesting troops. Uh, Aquaticus deals light splash damage to three random enemies and explodes half the blue gems on the board. Has some spell reduction and submerges all allies on four or more gems. Uh, I'm not going to pronounce this because everybody pronounces this differently. Um, most people don't use this in teams anymore. It used to show up in blue guild wars all the time. Since I don't do guild wars, I don't know if it still does, but even when I was doing them, I didn't see it too often. I believe he's pretty easy to counter. Uh, as far as your legendaries, you got Leviathan and Nimu. Uh, Nimu, yeah. Converts yellow to skulls, red to purple. Silences the two strongest enemies. I still run across that in PvP now and then. Uh, Leviathan, nobody really uses that too much. Azura can be an actually uh, good for faction events or your Tuesday f uh, faction. Uh, pretty good for mana gen. Uh, if you're a mid mid game player, it's really easy to get. Do I suggest you use any event keys on this kingdom? Possibly. Aquaticus would not be bad to have. Uh, it looks like you're going to be able to get Merlantis to at least level 15. So, anyways, let's move on. The raid troop of the week is going to be Tuscor, which is a blue-green. And it has 20% skull reduction and the usual 3-5 to five times damage to uh, bosses. And its spell is... Magic plus four boosted by blue allies and enemies. So I think they want us to build a blue team. All right, and our glory troop of the week is Axolotl. It's an ultra rare, 10 mana, blue yellow, and it's a merfolk beast. And its spell is a mix of 18 blue and yellow gems. So it can kind of refill itself. Uh, and it's third third trait is gain bonus blue mana. Uh, moving on, Tuesday faction, Silver Necropolis, which is purple brown, which is one of those good color combos, at least for me, because I can run wh whatever I run up front, probably Mountain Crusher, something like that, uh, Tina, Arachnian Weaver, Leprechaun, and just fly through with true damage. Uh, Wednesday, pet is Krabby, and Thursday, the class is Tidecaller. You're going to need that up to level 40 to get 15 stars in Blackhawk, I believe. And other than that, Saturday is a pet day. There's no event this weekend, and it's going to be Sharky from Blackhawk. Other than that, I will be back tomorrow with some raid teams for everybody. And I don't believe I have any more information, so I'm going to let you go. And thanks for watching. Have a great Sunday, and we'll catch you later.